Hey guys, a uh, real quick video. I want to show you how to replace the uh, oil pressure sensor on the engine. This is a 2013 Peterbilt 367 with a Cummins ISX 15, right, from the same year. Now the sensor is a 4921517, cost about 116 here in Midland. Yesterday my engine pressure shot up from 40, 35 to 40 where it usually sits uh, to about 60. So I pulled into the gas station, opened the engine, looked around. I saw the sensor was wet and um, when I got back on the engine and turned it on, it went up to 100, right? So the, the sensor was obviously damaged, you know, it's got, you probably can't tell, but it's got oil on the inside. So that means that it broke through and bust it off right um, the sensor sits right next to the fuel filter ECM back there back there right. so the ECM will have two connectors one on the top one on the bottom and the sensor plug will go right in the middle right you got to pull this uh, heating sheet to the back I don't know what I'm talking about and expose that pin you gotta, that pin's gonna be facing down inside, so it's a bit of a troublemaker. Um, so when you remove the ECM plugs, or the ECM connections, you'll have more room. You have to come in through this side, right back here. Pull the pin, remove the sensor, the sensor connector. Remove the sensor with a one and one sixteenth deep socket, right? A half extension and your wrench and, and it fits perfect. Check it out. I get a little bit sunny, but check it out. It fits perfect. Right? It's a quick tug, man. It I mean just half a turn and it'll be loose. Don't need to do too much, don't break it. Don't break it, you're not gonna be able to get it out. I use this to pry the uh, the sensor tail off, the sensor safety off. You can um, you can really use uh, a pin, a pick that's on the curve or that or however you can figure it out also you're gonna need a one of this hex allen wrenches number four to remove the sensors the ECM connectors you can see it's got those right here so it'll unscrew and come out this is for some of you who might not know I didn't fucking know I never removed that so all right but this is how you do it and then you know just go backwards stick it in there Give it a half a turn, just snug, right? This is gonna be facing down. This sensor is gonna be facing down like that. Plug it, safety it, connect your two ECMs, plugs back, boom, boom. Make sure they're nice and snug, and you're good to go, man. All right, y'all be safe.